Video Studio 21 has a whole new bunch of brand new instant project templates, tailor-made to save you time while editing videos. From vertical video templates built for social media, easy picture-in-picture -picture projects for your gaming footage and webcam, and super quick ways to reformat clips to work in a differently oriented project, or quickly create stylish or funny time delay clips. In this tutorial, we'll take a look at how to apply and then how to customize an instant project template. And then we'll go through how you can easily create your own instant projects to save yourself even more time. You'll find templates on this menu and you can preview a template to see what it's going to look like. You can also tell from here whether the template creates a standard horizontal video or a vertical video or a square video, which could be more suitable for some social platforms or viewing on phone screens. When you find a template that suits your needs, just drag and drop it to the timeline and all the placeholder clips and anything else in the templates will appear. And Video Studio will automatically adapt the project properties to match the template, which in this case is a vertical HD video, 1080 pixels across and 1920 pixels high. Replacing the placeholder clips is easy. Make sure replace mode is enabled here. And then you can just drag and drop your clips on top of the placeholders and they will take on any effects or motions that the placeholders had. If I double click my clip and go to the effect tab, we can see the light effect has been applied. And in the color tab, the exposure has been reduced, both to darken the clip in slightly different ways so that the text overlay can be seen. So let's take a look at the text layer. We can see for this template, there's a transition at the start and end of the title clip to fade the text in and out. So now I'll edit the text. Let's type in an inspirational quote here. Then I'll edit the font and the font size of each line for a bit of distinction. And then center it. And as I play it back, you can see the title fades in and out because of those transitions at the start and end. And now my video is basically ready and I can export it as a vertical video ready to post to social media. But we can also just use the template as a starting point and customize it even further to whatever we need. An instant project template is a set length. This one is 10 seconds. But what if you want it to last longer? Just drag all the clips out to the length you need them to be. We can also fine tune which part of the video clip is displayed by using the slip tool. For example, I can move the in and out point of my clip while keeping the clip length and clip position in the project the same, which is handy to easily show the section of your clip that works the best in this template. In this case, I like the way the clip ends with the car going into the tunnel. And if you want to add more clips to the project, you could easily do that by dragging and dropping, of course. But the problem here is that the light effect and the exposure settings aren't copied over to the new clip. So instead, we could copy and paste the original clip and then use replace mode to drag and drop a new clip. And I'll move the new clip partially on top of the first clip so that a random transition is added and extend the other clips to match the new running time. And now the new clip has the same properties as the original clip, keeping that consistent look for the project. Other instant project templates, like this one, have customized motion animations applied. Let's drag our video clips in. We can select and drag multiple video clips to replace multiple placeholders at the same time.
And we can customize these motions however we like by right clicking a clip and adjusting the keyframing. I'll add a second motion to these clips so that after they come to rest from their entrance, they then switch places. In a themed intro template, we'll just populate this one with a clip. We can get creative with the text editor and do some color editing to make it stand out the way we want it. Or we can change the text transition for a different effect. or in a time delay template. We just drag one clip to fill all of the placeholders at once. But we still have separate control over each clip. I can maybe add a different LUT in the color tab for each clip. Or I could add different mask frames to each clip. Or even create your own instant project templates for edits that you want to reuse time and again but that need to be easily customizable for different contexts. Maybe you've got a good themed intro that you've made yourself, but you want to swap out the title and the video clips for each new episode. First, right click and mark replaceable clips for the clips you want to be replaceable with replace mode. And then just go to file, export as template, instant project template. Choose a thumbnail for the template so you can easily recognize it. Then, when you want to use that template in a new project, you can easily replace the clips. and customize the episode title. So save yourself some time, get creative, and put the all new instant project templates to good use. Happy editing.